Alrighty then, welcome back and thanks for checking in. Now last year I made a moss removing brush that goes on the end of my combi system, on the end of a strimmer. It had one problem. It was very dangerous to use. It would take your leg off, it would bounce around, it was not very good. So luckily for me, Hyundai got hold of me the other week and said, Nate, we would love you to trial one of our machines. Have a look, see what you want. Now I thought having one of each would be a little bit cheeky, so I went for the weed ripper, being as I did have a use for it. And true to their word, a couple of weeks later, this turned up. So for those of you who are interested in serial numbers, it's the Hyundai Yard Weeder HYY W70. For all you unboxing fans who love to see it all put together, sorry, you're going to miss out because I'm just going to spend half an hour sticking a load of bolts and bits together. Right, there it is. Took me about 45 minutes to put it together. Looks all right. I'm going to put a cable tie around there. Don't like those being left loose. Everything else seems okay. I have put oil in there, I have put fresh petrol in there, and I've set these on the highest setting, so they're adjustable, so I'm guessing it's highest setting. I was expecting kind of a, a wheel to be here, um, but I'm guessing that takes all the pressure, and you take it off the handles. Right, let me put you down somewhere, and we'll give it a start, a first start, see how many pulls it takes. I'm guessing four, four pulls. Let me just check the oil again. Oh, if you're wondering where I am, this is my mate's workshop. He's kindly said I can use it for doing stuff like this, which is ideal. If it's a bit flickery, it's because the lights. I will see what I can do on the edit. Do any of you use Hyundai products? I'm guessing this is around the 500 pound mark, which is maybe a quarter of dedicated kind of Westermans and those other machines, but for occasional use, I'm hoping it'll do the job. Oh, that's perfect, I would say. Right, I guess four poles. I'm meant to go, one, two, three, four. Uh, all the way down, I'm guessing. Right, first pull. Who knew? Hyundai. Well done. That part of the workshop floor is now real clean. So, um, I say clean, it's blown all the dust everywhere, but Matthew won't know. Sorry, mate. Um, I'm now going to load that onto the van, go to one of my commercial jobs, find some moss and do some moss removal. So, uh, yeah, keep watching. Cheers. Right, I'm going backwards to park. It's a few days later and after I left the workshop that day, everything got uh, held up. So, I'm out on Saturday morning. And uh, while I am going backwards, I best tell you that Hyundai have given me this machine to use and to demo and to review, but they're not paying me to do it. So um, I'm not sure why I got to say that, but other people say it. So I've said it. Right, we're here. Okay, so we're going to make a start on this area. As you can see, this bit of car park goes down here. And there's a fair bit of moss and weeds. Yeah, it runs all the way down there. So I'm going to give that a little blow with the blower first, and then I'll, um, yeah, show you this uh, weed ripper in action. Right, annoyingly, I'm no filming pro. He was on time warp. So what I did do was measure the nylon bristles to see how much they're going to weigh. So I'm going to remeasure them for you in normal speed, because, um, yeah, I was going a bit fast. Let me show you them again. So they're 10 inches. I should have recognised 10 inches. I didn't measure that. There's nylon with um, steels in the middle, so, middle, so I'm quite interested to see how much they're going to weigh.
Right, I've given that one pass. I'm gonna give it a brush and a blow to see what it's like. I'm not bashing it right into the corners for now because I don't wanna kill the brussels, bristles, brushes, whatever they are. I'll show you in a minute what it looks like after one pass. Let me do a second pass and I'll show you how it looks then when I'm gonna leave it because uh, two passes here will be enough, I think, to make it a bit tidier. But yeah, I'm quite impressed so far. The brushes, bristles, don't look like they've worn down at all. So I will uh, measure them after the second pass. Okay, so I can see barely any wear on those brushes, bristles, whichever. That's after the second pass. Now I would say that's 100% better. There's areas of weeds still right in the corner, which I'll be treating with weed killer. And there's areas where the moss hasn't come out, but the tarmac is kind of um, low in places. So I don't particularly want to completely rip it all out. So I'm going to move up onto some curb edging now and show you those. Quite impressive. Right, I'm going to try it on these edges of block paving, but it's all up and down this block paving. And it's a bit of a pain to scrape with the scraper, so let's give it a go with this. Right, so on a single pass, I would say it's not perfect, but it's 100% better from what it was. Right, I'd say they've worn down about five mil, a couple of mil. So I've used that machine for about 45 minutes in this site, and if I was being paid to clean all the areas up, then I'd have gone over it twice in a lot of areas, and it would have done, done really well. It did really well anyway, I'm quite impressed. If you've watched the channel before, normally I'm a fan of buying the best bit of kit you can have, and I think these are around £450. Actually, if you go to Hyundai, I think they got 15% off now this next couple of weeks, I think. So uh, you haven't got to put a code in, you haven't got to put a code of We Love Nathan or anything, but um, yeah, just uh, go to this site and they got 15% off. So yeah. I'm really impressed, like I was going to say, I normally say you get the best bit of kit you can buy. I've been looking at these machines for about three years, I haven't bought them purely because I haven't had the need for one to justify the cost, so I've carried on manually scraping, and that's the first time I've used one of those rotating uh, weed rippers, moss brushes, whatever you want to call it. It's always difficult, I suppose, to give you full kind of thoughts on the machine when you've only just used it briefly. And my initial thoughts are it's very, very good. And I'm not saying that just because I've been given it. It's actually a good bit of kit. It's done the job, it's light to use, it's quiet. There's nothing really majorly wrong that I can see with it. The one thing I would add to it, if I was gonna engineer the thing, would be the brush. I would like to be able to rotate it a couple of degrees one way and the other way, just to get into the camber of some of the corners. I've given it a quick look over. There's no bolts come loose. There's nothing that looks like it's fallen apart. It's started, it's stopped straight away. It's been, the engine's been fine. There's been no issues with it. Like I say, I'm only maybe an hour into the machine at most. So what I'll do, I'll use it for a, a few weeks, a few months, and I will do another review further down the line. They come with a three year warranty. I'm guessing that's domestic. I'm not 100% sure. You'd have to check in with Hyundai for that. I've enjoyed it. First time I used one. It's a nice, easy machine to use. There's no fatigue in there. 
it's like pushing an empty pram, if that makes sense. And uh, yeah, you just push it around. You can lift the handles up and lift the brush off the ground to go a lighter touch on the, the paving. If you're on the block paving like I was on there, I didn't want to scratch it, so I just lifted it up slightly. Still took the moss off in between. The last thing sent to me to review, I gave away. And unfortunately, I'm gonna keep this because I will use it because it's a hell of a lot easier than scraping or using the leg removing tool that I made. Okay, if you got this far into the video, it'd be great if you can give us a like and a subscribe if you wanna keep up to date with the channel. If you wanna know more about these machines, go over to Hy Hyundai, if I can say it, Hyundai, Hyundai, whichever one it is. Hyundai, by the way. Uh, yeah, like I say, they got a sale on at the minute. I think there's 15% off these machines at least. So if you're looking for one of these and this is the price point that you are at, then have a go. Because I think if I had a job to do with one of these, it would pay for itself in one or two goes. So thanks to Hyundai for sending it out. And cheers for checking in. I will catch you all later. I didn't smash any windows. Bonus. Catch ya.